Okay, so what is once again up, everybody on YouTube? This is True Bros Gaming HD coming straight at you with yet again another video. I hope that you guys had a good weekend so far. It is Sunday today, so that means we're gonna get back to school, back to job, and back to normal day life tomorrow on Monday. So it's gonna be pretty dope. I surely hope that you had a good weekend here in Denmark. The weather has been phenomenal, so it it so far has been a good good weekend for me I guess so um, yeah we are gonna go ahead and play the 2000, 2019 farm simulator right here and as you can see I just bought a lots of Fiat 1000 DT series right here and also just a 1000 as you can see right here so um, I actually customized these right here. These tractors or this tractor right here was a, a mod that came out some weeks ago and uh, I haven't been playing with it because I didn't have the time to do it. So right now I'm going to go ahead and take a closer look at what this tractor actually looks like. And you can see right here you have a different amount of configuration that I actually uh, have, have gone with and actually have played with right here. So for example this one right here, this is the normal two wheel drive uh, tractor. And on this I got the super wide wheels on the back of it like I can call it almost flotation tires because they would basically float on the water so you can see right here they are really really uh, huge as you can see uh, I guess they are approximately one meter wide or so and uh, if you go into the vehicles right here you can actually go over I just downloaded the mod from the mod hub on the PS4 which I do play on but you can go right here, here we have the 1000 series 2 wheel drive and the 1000 series 4 wheel drive or all wheel drive uh, AVD. So if you go to this right here, we can go to, oh, we can just take this one right here. We have a different configuration, for example rim color you can change that, the sign color you can change that. You can also change the main color of the tractor if you want to go ahead and do that. But orange is the normal color for a Fiat tractor like this, like the old Fiat. So I'm just going to keep the color like it is. But here you can actually change from Trelleboy, Nokian, Michelin, Mitus, Lizard, Trelleboy. You have one, you have one, two, three, four, and five different uh, tire setups. So you can see right here is the crawler track, which you just have on the back of it. You can also get crawler track on a boat like front and back so that is pretty nice too and I got boat options up there on the game so that's cool but let's go back again and let's go to Michel Lang and let's go to white tires and extra white tires right here as you can see so this right here I'm just gonna buy that once again and we're gonna go out and check it out now I do also have the white tires in front and you, you actually have like different kind of, uh, these are also white tires, but the Michelin is just wider than this. So that's why I just bought that. And you can see, you can actually see how wide the, both the front tires and the back tires are. They are really, really wide. So that is definitely a special uh, tire setup, this. Uh, definitely some, some cool looking stuff, uh, in my opinion, really. And, uh, yeah, it just looks uh, great. It just looks great. Let's go ahead and park just between this this one right here. Let's go ahead and see if we can go do that. Right here. How perfectly is that? So now we like parked these two bad boys together. And you can see that is indeed a good ass on both of these. So let's go ahead and see again right here. I do have this, which is a normal tire setup, I will call it. And I do have this with, with twin tires right here. Oh, this was the quality track, which is also like pretty special. That you can actually get the four wheel drive one with the quality track in front and quality track in the back. So what I actually guess right here is that the tracks or the tire setup is actually more expensive than the tractor in real life. I think, I don't know how much a 1000 series of Fiat is, but it is not that expensive. However, I know that the tires, or at least the quality tracks right here, is quite expensive. 
and also the big flotation ties is quite expensive. Let's go ahead and see what this tractor can actually do with the horses, how much it can pull, and how much it actually can do. So it has it actually has 110 horses under the under the hood, which is really and you can actually change the Indian setup to Oh, you can change the setup, the engine setup to 100, 185, which is sick. 185 horses, which is insane. I'm just going to go ahead and see if I can get that. Let's take the Michelin again, and let's take the extra wide tires. Oh, and let's take the, the engine setup as a 1,300 1, DT tuned right there and then we're gonna go ahead and do this right here and let's go ahead and take a cultivator right here if we can go ahead and do that um cultivators right there and let's find the biggest one that can actually be put on this Right here, let's go ahead and find it and see what we can actually do. Um, maybe power cultivator, maybe not. Maybe disc arrows. Uh, I just want something big for it actually because it looks more cooler or more cool. What about this? Is that 180? This is six meters. I think this is actually gonna be the one, the Amazon right here. And it's gonna be this one right here, just the standard version. Let's go ahead and throw that on. Right here. Oh, it's a little bit heavy. You can see that it actually lifted the front. But I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can head to the field with this. That would be really cool. Yeah, it actually goes pretty cool. And again, this is ooh, it's a little bit heavy. This is the the 1,300 uh, DT tuned one. And we're actually gonna head for the field right now. And it has a six meter wide uh, cultivator setup on the back of it, which is pretty freaking awesome. Oh, it's lifting a little bit, which is insane. Which is really insane. Let's get up to the field right here. Let's put it down. I'm basically just go ahead and actually cultivate the, the, the crops right here. However, it is not that good to actually just <laughs> uh, cultivate down fresh crops. But we're going to go ahead and do it anyways. And you can see right here, it actually managed it really good. 18 km or 17 kilometers per hour on this with a six meter cultivator is really cool but it got the horses it got the traction it got everything it needs to actually go ahead and pull a machine like this so that is exceptional and that is really cool to see indeed you can see right here oh my god it's it's freaking lit and we're actually gonna go around right there Uh, okay, it's actually pretty symmetrated right there. It's pretty cool. And it's pretty good right here also. So it goes as you want it to go. It goes good. It goes nice. And it goes easy right here. And it is really cool with the, uh, with the big tires and stuff. Right there. So I guess that's going to be the one for this video. So I just want to say once again, thanks for watching. And thanks for tuning in on Tuberous Gaming HD once again. And please hit the thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to the channel. Because we're going to we're gonna give you guys a lot of new videos in the future, of course. So uh, thanks for coming through again. Hit the thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. And um, yeah, then we're going to see you guys 
in the next one as always. Thanks guys. Thanks. Bye.